which we spared no expense at. This white chalk line. I'm ready. All right. Give us a hard one. I have a few hard ones. I have a few easy ones. Okay. okay. This guy is a potential so first question, guy in the box. So Scotty's got to keep his eye on him because he speaks up. Right. He's not embarrassed to. Red selling car of all time. Just shout it out. You get as many guesses as you want. Ford Ranger. Ford Ranger. That's not it. Mustang. That's not it. Come on. Huh? It's so Scotty has asked which is the most popular car. Oh, God. That's a good guess. Is that your uh, final answer? Sorry, there's a lady dressed inappropriately, hey, and I'm trying to keep the camera off so her. we don't block the way. That's why we have a chalk line. Come up to the line, just don't cross the line. So Scott is trying to get them up to the line. It's real hard. People are like cheap, and they have to be herded. Model T, good. It's the crowd sticking up a little bit, which is really neat. What's the best? Hey, are you gonna get me with it? No, I'm giving away mine. Hey, what's the best sign? Fight. Here's a hint. Everybody had one of these when they were in high school. Scotty's getting the crowd to clap yeah, because clapping draws in more people. What is so America's favorite Human nature to be curious. Chocolate chip. Chocolate chip. Everybody says that all at the same time. That's not it. What is America's favorite cookie? Just shout it out. Oreo. Oreo is correct. He wins the money. Give him the Hey, uh, so uh, what brought you down here to Huntington Beach? We were actually in uh, Cameron Island. 
with like uh, Judaism or the Bible, the Old Testament, things like that. Really? Do you know what Passover is? We just celebrate, Jews just celebrated Passover, I think it was Tuesday. Yesterday was Good Friday. The significance of that is that was the day when Jesus Christ died. And that's why we're commemorating Good Friday, because he paid for the sins of the world. Sunday, tomorrow, is Easter Sunday, and that's the day that we celebrate or commemorate as him rising from the dead. And it's good news to all of us who are dead in trespasses and sin. Now I can tell you're getting a little anxious there. I have not forgotten the money, I promise you. But I want to make a point here. You've heard a lot of information. Yeah. You understand that if you try to make it on your merit, you're not good enough, nobody's good enough. But Jesus Christ is without sin. He who knew no sin became sin for us. And he died on the cross to pay your fine so that you could have those things that you enjoy in life. Breath, sight, the ability to, to uh, enjoy life and relationships. I want to ask you, did you prove to be a good person by that high standard that I held up, God's standard? Shall not lie, steal, commit adultery. Did you prove to be a good person by that standard? No. So you didn't earn the money. But just as we didn't earn salvation and it was given to us as a free gift, I want to give you the five dollars as a free gift just as a token and to remember what this was all about. Now I have one more question for you. Give me a Thank you for participating. Give me a hand. I got a pretty good. 